Okay, so now obviously she's part of my hair and stuff and I'm just sat in my mirror because she came to mind. I'm now sat in my mirror and I'm like, okay, let's go, it's go time. Let's go, let's go, it's go time, yeah? Cool. Guys, when I tell you, oh my God, I remember, the, I can, I remember the pain. I remember the burning sensation on my head. I actually remember the burning sensation on my head. So she started on the right side of my head first, yeah? Because obviously when you relax, you part your hair into sections so you can do it like properly. So I remember she started on this part of my hair first. And then, guys, I kid you not. I kid you not. I'm not even listen. As soon as she placed the relaxer on my head you know like when you're doing relaxing hair you're meant to put it on the roots first and then you put it on the entire hair she had just finished putting it on the roots and obviously part of it touches your scalp in it <sighs> guys as soon as she was done on this part putting it on the scalp please tell me why my head was burning you know like there's relaxer burning after it's been sat in your hair for like 10 15 minutes yeah that's fine because you know it's cooking you know your hair is in the baking process yeah but like <laughs> this is burning i was like this is a different kind of sensation you know the way i was just sat in my chair and maybe it's because i haven't relaxed my hair for so long i was just so confused as to why like it was burning so quickly but i was just like maybe it's just because i haven't relaxed it for so long maybe i was telling myself maybe 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 she got to like the back part of that of my the right side of my head and then i just remember this front part just burning and i was just like to her listen yeah my head is burning you know and she's like girl that's just what relaxer does like don't worry that's just what relaxer does i was like girl my head is burning and you're telling me relax my head is burning you know what i said it was burning like I feel like if I had kept that relaxer on, yeah, it would have eaten into my skin. I'm not even going to lie to you because the way it was burning, like, oh my gosh. So I said to her, listen, darling, yeah, this is what we're not going to do anymore because this sensation that I feel on my head is not a normal kind of sensation and a sane person will not allow the sensation to keep going on. So I was just like, no, 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 no. I need to wash this, this relaxer off my head right now because because no this is not this is not ordinary sensation and i just could not do it i ran to the bathroom and i was like please please let's wash it out let's wash it out because at this point i was at this point tears were streaming down my face so she was like okay 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 guys please tell me why as she was washing out my hair i saw clumps of my hair and it, oh my god <laughs> I saw clumps of my hair coming out in the shower. Days went by and I would comb my hair and hair would be coming out. Hair would be coming out. I was so devastated. So devastated because I never expected something like that to happen, you know. I just felt like, you know, being able to see my hair, I can change up my look. I can, but if it's, it's a, if my hair's mash up, I can't, I can't change my look. If my hair's mashed off, I can't be versatile, do you know what I mean? So it really, like, got to me. After that, obviously, I tried to, like, do hairstyles and stuff to kind of conceal it. So I think I, I used to, like, because obviously this side of my hair, from, so from, like, so from, like, this braid, this side, it, my hair was fine, but it was just this part. And when I tell you, it literally looked as if, like, I shaved this part and it was a style that I was rocking. You know that Rihanna thing that she did where she shaved this part and she had this part? That's what it looked like. That's literally what it looked like. It looked like I actually intentionally shaved off the side of my head. But no, I never would have intentionally done such a style like that in my whole entire life. So I was really just upset because it was just kind of like people think I'm looking a style that I never actually intended to do. And I don't know if I even like it. But I tried to kind of make it work anyways because I used to try and kind of style my hair in different ways. But now I look back and I cringe. But at the time, you know, I was still doing my thing. Do you understand? So oh, I, I was just so like 
I was just, and I used to just look at it. Like, you know when you just stare at something in the mirror and you just shake your head? This, I would do that, I would just look at it and be like, girl, you have been through it. <laughs> when I went to, came to uni, I had braids and stuff like that. And I tried to rock a, a weave. And obviously when I came to uni, that's when I learned about wigs and stuff. But I tried to rock a weave when I came to uni. And it was just absolutely just, like, despicable. Because obviously, like, my leave out required, like, some sort of attention. But because of the traumatic thing that I had been through, I said, I'm not touching relaxer again. Actually, that was the last time I touched relaxer. The last time I touched relaxer. So I said, I'm never touching relaxer again. And I was just like, I was even scared to put apply heat to my hair because I was just like, I don't know what kind of damage I would do as well. And then, lo and behold, I think some one of the girls that I was friends with was just kind of like, do you know what, like, why don't you just cut your hair? Because obviously, like, I was seeing everybody was doing fine, babe, with their wigs anyways. I was just like, me, I haven't yet, you know, raised the funds to even buy a wig like that. So I was just kind of like, okay, like, let me actually just do the big chop i mean at this point part of my head is cut is come off anyway so what harm could it do so 2017 i believe it was november i did the big chop and i cut all my hair off i cut it off and i remember the night i was like oh my god i don't know if i should cut it i don't know what i should do like i don't know if i should cut it and my friend was just like do you know what let me just cut it for you but i remember when she cut it like obviously she started 